Entertainment Group's Vivo Power Station Sorel Suite. We're catching up with various actors, producers, writers, and everybody in between that's here to catch all the films Sundance has to offer. <laughs> that is what brings you out to Sundance. I have a movie called LUV. Oh, with, with and that premieres yeah, with Danny and uh, Charles Dutton and Michael Rainey Jr. and Tommen. This is the first film I've been a part of that's in the Sundance, so I'm super, super excited. I'm promoting two movies here right now, um, Robot and Frank and The Bachelorette, or Bachelorette it's called, not, not like the TV show. We played a show together last night, yeah. a little bit of dance. Yeah. Have you caught any films while you're here? Any what? Any films? That's what we're here for, right? Oh, Film festival! Oh. <laughs> Hey, we're here with John Hader at Sundance. What brings you to the festival this year? Oh, you know, the regular uh, excuses. Uh, no, I'm in a film. I'm in a film. Uh, for, for Ellen. Yeah, premiered last night. Did great. It's awesome. Everybody has been saying that your suite is the suite to be in. Well, that's humbling. Uh, and I'm thankful to hear that. We bring out brands, amazing brands from different corners of the industry to offer filmmakers, celebrities, something that is memorable, unique, and you know, something that they won't forget. I just can't believe how rocking it is here at four in the afternoon. It wasn't like this when I used to come to Sundance. I felt like Little Miss Sunshine, like, <laughs> I like to think, like, no, I'm not greedy, and then it's like, free <laughs> stuff, like, oh my god. We like to think that music is an undertone to everything that we do. So when people come in, they can create a celebrity playlists, and then they're blasted throughout the venue. Mm -hmm. Every year, this is kind of. We decided last year we played, we went for the third year in a row, and we said we don't even really care like what the deal is. We're gonna figure out a way to come to Sundance every year. It's just one of the most fun things we do every year. I'm jealous. You know, I wake up in the morning and outside of my window there's the chairlift, You're and Filipino, I can't. Right? Yeah. So I didn't know Filipinas snowboard. I didn't know black people snowboard either. <laughs> What brings you out to the snow? Um, actually, I'm here accompanying my friend John Forte, and he's uh, doing a performance uh, at the ASCAP Cafe, and I'm just going to kind of jump on stage and join him for a bit. It's my first time to Sundance, so very excited. Ian, so nice to meet you. What brings you out to Sundance? I got to be in a film that's screening tonight. It's called For a Good Time Call. And um, I've been enjoying the butt clench exercises of walking up and down Main Street and trying not to wipe out. I'm telling you, I'm going to have an, a butt of steel. I wish you could feel it. All right, get over here. <laughs> It was this snowy and I'd need snow boots. Yeah. So when I got them and I got here, I was like, thank God. Yeah, I think it's just a great experience. People can come in, they can vibe. We have a we have a bar provided by Ciroc. We had snake oil mixologists, which they're amazing. I know. I, I think I tested out four or five drinks of my own because they're so good. I know, I know, naughty, naughty on the job. I'm having a great time. Sundance is fantastic. I got some burgers, I got some wine, I'm about to get some snow boots, pumped up. Life is good. 